And you say, Walter, that the White House is outsourcing government ethics to an art dealer. Why? They've put an art dealer in charge of keeping a secret. And really what he's doing is keeping a secret from the public because eventually the Hunter Biden or people in the White House will learn who it's going to be. In fact, Hunter Biden, we now know, is going to be at two art showings where he will meet the universe of bidders on his art. So they left that detail out when they told us he had no way of knowing who was buying his art. Now, obviously, the adult children of presidents have jobs. They have lives. They may even have hobbies. But art, you say, is actually sort of different because of the nature of it being priced somewhat capriciously and that it is can be at a very high end used to actually launder money and other things. Explain how art is different and what the right way to do this might have been. So there's no intrinsic value to the art. It's whatever anybody says they want to pay for it. Mm -hmm. The problem is they're buying it from the president's son at prices that you would never see for a first-time art sale. There's a local artist collective in Alexandria, Virginia, just outside Washington, D.C., where if you go, really well-established artists who've been doing this for years and have quite a following are selling for two to $5,000. And he's not even at that level because this is his first sale. So it really doesn't matter whether anyone likes his art or not. The question is, can you find anyone other than a president's son who showed up on the scene and started selling for the cost of a house and a half? Because $295,000 was the price of the average home sale last year, and he's selling for up to 500. So should we know then who the buyer is? Should the American public know? And what kind of assurances does the White House need to give? So ideally, Hunter Biden wouldn't be doing this because it sure looks like profiting off the presidency. But if they couldn't talk him out of doing it, there is something that's within their control. They could promise us today that if they happen to learn who any of the buyers are, they will notify us immediately and they will tell us again if any of those buyers get a meeting with the White House or any other political appointee. Or I guess Hunter Biden could do this under an, a pen name. And his uh, real value to be established by the market, not his name. I have a feeling if he did it under a pen name, he wouldn't get much for it. That's no. a very interesting we'll Walter Schaub, good to see you.